Hi, Mila. She wants in there. Oh no. Oh my gosh. She's hot. She's a big girl. Big girl's got to cool down. Wow. So we had to buy a whole new refrigerator just for Stacy's cold dog food. Yeah. Thankfully. You know, we feed a bunch of dogs and they're fat like this one. So we, uh, we found a cheap refrigerator and got it for Stace. <laughs> She's got a whole bowl of water back there, but she'd rather drink cold. I don't think that's good for her. Is it? No. Not that much. You should stop Myla. Myla. Hey. Hey. You mind? What's up? You want a Is nice ice cold bath? <laughs> huh? Go get it. Jeez. So yeah, we're just uh, packing the refrigerator full right now. Or I am. I'm watching her slurp up some uh, ice cold water. Yeah, it got to the point where we made the decision. Ew, we were forced to make the decision. It's like, do we want to keep buying ice for the coolers over the course of the next several months to keep this stuff cold? And uh, honestly, it was cheaper just to buy a fridge. Yeah. Because gas station ice is expensive. Definitely so. So. We got this old one. We actually uh, bought it from a family member and we got it very cheap, so pretty cool. Dog food's not gonna go. Ah! <laughs> Thanks, that was easy. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna argue with that. I suck at stacking, what can I say? She really does. <laughs> my hands are Whoops. cold. Yeah! Is that it? We're done? Done! That is cold dog food there's no room for beer i'll put it up the heck dude there's a top shelf oh okay yeah. perfect right, here we go <laughs> done cool man shutting her so it can get cold my hands are cold don't pay attention to the mess um oh it was it was an undertaking definitely so uh we're not done yet and our house is always a mess you guys know that it's just the way we live much. our lives oh well we live here <laughs> <laughs> it is what it is Dang. Like literally guys, we've been working at this all day long. Yeah, all day. Literally all day long. Maybe so I glad to be done with it. Me too. Are you happy? Cold hands. Yeah. Awesome. Oh yeah, for sure. Looks a little bit different than it did last time we were here. What do you see? Big blood. Did they dump all this? There's a bunch of these bags in here. They probably use it on the inside. Okay. Yep. Anything? Nope. Over there? Uh-oh. Jackpot. Hey, can you pull forward a little bit more? Huh? Can you pull forward a little bit more? Oh, never mind. Sorry. Jackpot. Get all the getting good, guys. Okay. We had a feeling this one, ow, dang it, that this one might be good. When we saw the couch on top. And here we go. Hiking snacks. Yeah, we've been doing a lot of hiking here lately. Actually, quite a bit. I had a goal. All right. 
I had a goal of 10 miles this week and I was able to achieve it which is pretty cool Speaking of hiking, I took Lucas with me and uh, he brought the shovel with him in case we had to dig treasure, obvious, and also in case we ran into any dinosaurs. Now we're going to use it to scoop some dumpster treasure. dumpster stick and the grabbers at home. Oops. Oh my gosh, Stacy, there's still so much. Are you getting in? I'm getting to, yeah. right. One of us needs to. Okay. Oh yeah. Sit here and get comfortable as I'm throwing all of this junk out, which is kind of cool. Hopefully, that couch don't fall on me. If it does, I'm leaving you. Here. <laughs> you don't leave me? Did y'all hear that? You're so mean. I thought you loved me. <sighs> I do, but sometimes you gotta cut your losses, huh? <laughs> you think? I remember that. Hurry. I gotta go from one side to the next. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh god. You're good. Okay. Maybe. Maybe. Oh gosh. This thing's like. Okay, okay. We good, we good. <laughs> Somebody comes. Just uh. Oh, there's a crack over the big Yeah. Y'all see my Aunt Betty? <laughs> Holy shimon. Oh gosh, right now, so there's stuff underneath me. Is there really? Yeah. There's stuff inside that couch, too. <laughs> yeah, I see that. Hey, come on. Stand up, my legs are hurting. Okay. Okay. Holy crap, I cannot believe all this junk. for these little snacks here for the kids. Thank you. And the nacho chips too. Yeah. My goodness. What those boxes out there? You get all that. I am. I'm just like breathing, you know. My legs and crap are crampy. 
still so much crap in here. That big ass is gonna knock the couch over on you. Huh? So that big ass is gonna knock the couch over on you. <laughs> Shut up. Okay. Wow, okay. yeah, look at this. A lot of crap in here. I'm trying to drive my I can. <laughs> These are good. I like those. Those crispy coated peanuts. Oh. I'll spit it out eventually. I'm a little slow. It's been a long day. Cake icing. Huh? Cake icing? We never find that. I know. Alright, ready? Oh. I'm done. Good job, honey. Mm. That's got a hole in it. Okay. I'm gonna run out. Take your box back. Cool. It was a pleasure doing business with you. What is this anyway? Ice cream snack. Oh. Yes, they are. Thumbnail. Yeah. <laughs> Partially. Empty. Alright, we are done with that one. Uh, wasn't really supposed to be a dumpster dive per se, but you know, when you're out, you gotta look. Definitely, you cannot just pass up the dumpsters. We looked and we found. We got a whole truck bed full of snacks. Yes, hiking snacks. <laughs> We've been doing a lot of hiking here lately. Like I said, we did... Um, five miles today, Stacy and I. I made a commitment to myself that I was going to do 10 miles this week. And today, I cleared my goal. I passed 10 up. I think I'm closer to 12 right now. But now, I've got Stacy hooked on it. <laughs> and she wants to go again tomorrow. So, I might finish out at like 15 miles for the week, which is kind of cool. Never know. We'll see how it goes. We actually came out today to get Stacy a book. She was uh, hunting down this book right here. It's a stone artifact guide, Texas Indians. Basically Texas arrowheads, that kind of thing, right? Yeah, I'm huge into that stuff and I wanted a new book. <laughs> a new Texas book. Stacy loves like the whole, not even just the arrowhead. She loves the history of Indians and, and all that stuff. It's really cool. Something she gets into pretty heavy. Oh, absolutely. Ooh. Idea. Can we show your, yeah, can't talk. Can we show your arrowhead collection when we get home? Oh, yeah, sure. You want to? Yeah, I don't care. Okay, cool. That's fine. We'll do that when we get home. That'll be pretty fun. All right, guys, we are back home. We're done with that one entirely. You're not gonna believe this. This is kind of crazy. Sorry, the dogs are kind of loud, but check this out. Look at that. That is an insane amount of food, snacks, junk food, whatever you want to call it. But it's a lot, a ton, a ton of stuff. It didn't seem like that much when we were pulling it out. And I looked in the back of the truck and thought, whoa. I guess because Stacy and me were both pulling it out at the same time. But, uh, yeah. It's crazy. Crazy, crazy. This stuff, at even this amount, goes into the trash every single day. Just like this. So, pretty wild. Bunch of those. One of the reasons we started this YouTube channel was to show people who were struggling, like ourselves, that you know you can get out there and get some food for the family, get some snacks for the family, and uh, well, there it is.
Okay, I'm not too sure what Adam went over, but we got some of these uh, beech nut fruit and veggie bars. There's some other ones I saw in here too. I thought maybe they're all the same. Maybe I got confused because it says apple and spinach. Um, let's see, some Annie's oatmeal cookie bars. These little sugar packets that have caffeine and vitamin 12 in them. Kind of weird. Teddy Grahams, Famous Amos cookie things. We got some of these Nutri-Grain Kids soft baked mini bars. Cookies. Planters, crunchers, sea salt and black pepper. I haven't tried these before, but I guess I'll see if they're any good. It kind of sounds weird. Lots of chips. Gummy snacks. It's such a mess through here. <laughs> Some kind of Gerber popped crisp thingies. Icing. Birthday cake bars. These I cannot wait to try. Nature Valley biscuits with coconut butter. Oh gosh. And these weird Pop Tarts pretzels. Hello, Remy. Um, I know there's some stuff buried underneath everything as well. Cowtails. Candy. That's pretty much it. So I think all of it's under here might just be chips that are piled up. And some uh, lonely cookies back here. Soft, frosty lemon. So I believe that's pretty much it. Hopefully. Just a huge pile of stuff. Sorry, Petty. I did not mean to step on you. So yeah. That believe, I believe that does it. Oh, wait. Some cranberry, ra cranberry raisins. Alright, yeah, that does it in this whole big old pile. Okay, now Stacy is going to go over. And show some of my arrowheads that I have found. My only arrowheads. That I found so she has <laughs> some pretty cool stuff. She has yeah. like some scrapers and some bone awls and even a knife. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. We're just going to go over the arrowheads today. Yeah. Just for, uh, well, it's late and you're ready to go to bed, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm very tired. So <laughs> I'll, like, do the order that I found them in. <laughs> okay, and they each have their own story, right? Yeah, well, yeah, pretty much, if I can remember. The, the first story. one uh, that you found was in 2016? Yes, I had to look at them. Yeah, now, um, it wasn't for a lack of trying. We went out and she always wanted to find one, so it was really, really cool, the very first one that she found. Yeah, it's kind of a weird-looking one. I guess you would say. My dad said it was a blunt, maybe? I don't mm. know. Not the kind y'all are thinking about. Yeah. Oh, gosh. I don't know if we can get a good... Uh... But basically, it's like an arrowhead, but without a point. Right? Yeah. Okay. So, there's that one. I and was that just was kinda... her very first one. She yeah. found that one. When I was I... just kind of walking, and it was sticking out of the ledge, and I pulled it out, and there it was. Pretty cool. Mm -hmm. I was fishing. Yeah, yeah you were. That one. What was the order anyways? You know, I am pretty tired. Oh, yeah, that was. This one here is awesome. Is this? This is the second one that I found. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I, I screamed. Um, Adam was <laughs> out exploring. I was on top of a mountain. Yeah, yeah, on top <laughs> of a mountain. Not really a mountain, but it was it was. A, I don't, I don't know what the elevation change was, probably like 120 feet, but I was at the very top of it and she was down at the bottom yeah. looking around and I think I actually posted some video of that I way back know. in the day. I had the, yeah, we had walkie talkies and then I was just kind of walking around looking in some areas and then at the walkie talkie and I was like, oh my God. She Dad, freaked I was like, out. Be quiet. <laughs> <laughs> she freaked out. She was well, so no excited. Way. But yeah, there so, was just sitting yeah. there. And then I come running down a mountain full bore to For see that. Stacy holding that guy. Yeah, this one's beautiful. I love this one here. That Actually, one's probably your favorite, huh? I think the one I found the other day. Mike. Really? I don't know. Turn I, that one sideways so everyone can see how thin that thing is. It's very thin. It's actually made out of a flint chip. It's super sharp, too. It's amazing. It's absolutely beautiful nice thin 
Awesome. So that was her. Amazing. That was her first, like, true, like, you know, absolutely for sure arrowhead. (laughs) Yeah. Like your traditional style arrowhead. No denying it. All right, I'm gonna let this one back up. And she freaked out when she found it. We were so excited. It was really cool. It wouldn't be though. <laughs> yeah, I screamed on that one. All right, so that one. Y'all think Stacy gets excited over trash? You should see her when she finds one of these bad boys. <laughs> Extremely excited. It's a whole nother story. It's cool because it was like this one was 16, 17. I found this one in 2018. We were just kind of out walking, lollygagging around. The points actually broke off of this one here. And then you break it in half. Oh, I don't say that. Um, where was this one from? A creek. Right. So this particular one, uh, we drugged the kids on like a, what was that, like a three mile hike in the middle yes. of the summer. Yes. Not, not even really a hike. It was through the middle of the woods, fighting briars and everything else. And we finally made it there. Kids were playing in the water, having a good time, and of course, Stacy was walking around looking at the ground, and she found that little beauty. Mm-hmm. Yep. Pretty cool. Now, my 2019 find, which was a very weird, weird one. Um, oh, yeah. It's the house. Here. Underneath the carport. And I was like, what the, is this doing out here? She, okay, so let me, let me go ahead and tell the story. It was a hot, hot summer day, and I was sitting outside working on the go-kart, remember? Yeah. Busting up my knuckles. This thing was giving me a fit, and I was so irritated. And Stacy come out there to just talk to me like she does. And I remember she was, and I was like, man, I just wish she would shut the heck up and go back inside <laughs> so I can sit out here and be miserable by myself. And she looks down, and she goes, what the is that doing out here? Because, like, instinctively, you thought it could have been one of yours or something, right? Yeah. So she freaks out a little bit, reaches down, picks it up. I even went and I dug in my drawer <laughs> to make sure that the fake one was in there, and it was. The cool thing about where we live is there's flint chips, and you hear people finding arrowheads around us all the time. And we live on 1.8 acres here, and... Uh, there was actually a pretty big campsite. Like, what is that? Like a mile and a half, two miles yeah, that way? Yeah, And so. a creek actually runs through where we live. Or beside where we live. It's barred up in a tank, right? Yeah, right okay. down there. Yeah. yeah. So, so yeah, it was very, very unbelievable. Still to this day, I'm like, what the heck did that really happen? Yeah. But, yeah, uh, yeah check it out. That one's a very, very, very nice That's one. a beauty. Yeah. That is a beauty. Nice ears, good tip, just really amazing. I could still, not believe that. <laughs> I still can't believe it. <laughs> My 2019 find here in the yard. We really need to get out here and dig up our yard one day. <laughs> we really do. I mean, we've already got permission. We're in a back like, Go ahead, check it out. I'm like, all right. Yeah, the landlady thought it was too cool. I find flint chips out here all the time. Right, my couple of days ago find. Yeah, just a couple of days ago. Oh my god. We go on a hike. Uh, what, our four mile round hike? Yeah, four and a half. And we took Lucas, Joey's kid, which was absolutely hilarious. Yes, yes, yes. Child was a trip. (laughs) (laughs) But we walk down to this area. I look down, I see a flint chip. Just take a couple of steps looking down as I always do. Few steps, look, scream. And she literally did. I thought she saw a snake. I thought she had. I found that. That one's pretty nice. My brand new one. Put the paper towel in your hand and then lay it. Yeah. Well, it's probably about the same. No, that's. Oh. Oh. Shows up quite a bit better. This one's actually quite large. Your biggest one, right? Yes. My biggest. Fun. Pretty cool. Oh yeah. Yeah, awesome. She had to walk for that one. Four and a half miles. Well, four hey, and a half. it was worth it. Totally worth it. <laughs> I mean, I, I can't even believe I found that. So today's the first day that we've been out to uh, go dumpster diving in like a week because, you know, I set the goal for the 10 mile thing. She came along the one time and uh, found that. So she's been absolutely obsessed. So oh, yeah. that's yeah. probably what we're going to be doing for the next two weeks. So don't expect a whole <laughs> lot of videos. More. <laughs> Unless, of course, we do a little bit of filming. I'm 
I'm sure we'll be this. going out. I mean, look what we just found. Uh, it's True. It's going to be hard to say no to that. So. True. But it's hard to say no to this. Yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. so she's found, she's found one every year since 2016. Mm-hmm. Which is really, really cool. But I want to see how many you can find this year. <laughs> I know. I do, too. I've already got some places in mind that I'm going to take off to. I got my book. My book actually told me the name of the place, so I'm fixing to go hunt down. <laughs> I'm out! <laughs> gonna find more. Yeah. Add to the collection. She has a lot more stuff, too. But, yeah. Um, so, we'll have to go through that another day because there's quite a bit more stuff. Stuff that her dad's given her that's really, oh, really cool. Yes. Um, but that's for another day. For now. Good night, dear. Good night. <laughs> Love. Thanks for watching. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoy looking through these. I hope you all enjoy watching all of the goodies that we found. And we'll be back with another video soon, hopefully. It may not be that kind of video. It might be we'll have to just take the camera with us into the woods. Because <laughs> yeah. that's what we're going to be doing for the next several, several days. Probably so. Probably. You'll also probably get to watch Mila and Petty pal on in the water, too. That's it, guys. We will see you on the next one. Bye.